What's up, Jukationers? We're in Tagaytay City at the Starbucks of all places, overlooking Taal Volcano and this beautiful view of the Philippines and this dormant volcano. At least I hope it's dormant. Jaycationers, day four here in Cabuya, Laguna. We are headed over to Tagaytay today. We're going to Tagaytay today where Taal Volcano is and uh, go check out more of New Valley area. Need some coffee in me, guys. You know I can't function without that coffee. And NBA free agency is about to start, so I'm rocking my Lakers. Mari rocking his Barca. Props to Suarez last night for a great game. And uh, Umtiti and uh, Dembele making the uh, Final eight. <laughs> What's up, guys? We're here at the S Lex, uh, the expressway here in the Philippines from Colombo. We're on our way to uh, Tagaytay. We're stopping over here at the highway at Max's restaurant. We're gonna have some lunch. First time in Max's on this trip, so excited for that. This little pit stop area on the S Lex is pretty cool. They have Max's restaurant, they have Jollibee, they even have a Nike outlet store. And it's just like a little mini area where people can chill out. There's Ate. Hi guys! Oh my god! So we ordered garlic rice, regular rice, pork sinigang, pancit bihon, a bucket of Max's chicken, and some crispy pata. So that was Max's restaurant. I'm stuffed. That ube dessert was super good. Loved it. It was alright. It's not like what I remembered back in the days. Max Chicken was always good. Hey Jaycationers, so to review Max's restaurant on the SLX Highway, the chicken I've had better. I've been to the Max's restaurant in Pasadena and I remember the chicken just being out of this world. And Max's is known for its fried chicken. So I don't know if it was just the area we're in or if the chicken's just better here in the US. I don't know, but over there, that particular chicken was just okay. It wasn't bad, it was just okay. So I've also tasted it in Manila and Alabang, and it was actually better there too. So I don't know, maybe it was just the time of day or just the batch chicken, but it wasn't that great. Max's restaurant is a great family style place to take your family if you're visiting the Philippines and it's still fairly inexpensive. Hey, wala <laughs> masasabi. For you guys that don't know, SNR is basically like the Costco of the Philippines. You need a membership to go in there and you get all your Max Pack stuff over at SNR. I didn't even know that they had that. We're like at the world's nicest Starbucks that overlooks Taal Volcano here in Tagaytay. Dude, it is awesome. I just had Starbucks a little bit ago, but I'm down to have more just, just to see this view. It's awesome. We're just outside the Starbucks right here behind me and check out this view. What's up, Jaycationers? We're in Tagaytay City at the Starbucks of all places, overlooking Taal Volcano and this beautiful view of the Philippines and this dormant volcano. At least I hope it's dormant. Flashback. Hey, what's up? We're here. Taal Lake. I meant to say. Taal Lake. Tagaytay. So that was a bigger me in 2009 in Tagaytay, guys. And uh, yeah, I started vlogging back then. I just uh, put it on a DVD, never put it on YouTube. I still had a lot to learn. End of flashback. Hey, 
check out this view, guys. Hi. What's my car? No tape. No tape. So apparently there's also another Starbucks that's even doper that's also down the street, but I don't think we have time to check that out. We're gonna go check out this McDonald's that has some dope views of Tile Volcano. We're here at the Tagaytay McDo McDonald's. We call it McDo here in the Philippines. There's my mom's car. Anyways, um, it's got some of the best views and it's one of the nicest McDonald's in all of the Philippines. So let's go upstairs and take a look. Station room, I've never heard him call it that. Definitely McDuck with a view. Awesome. I don't know if we're really gonna eat anything. We're still full from lunch, so we're gonna head back into the car, head back towards Kabuyo. So let's go. Also guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, hit that subscribe button, Paki subscribe po, and uh, hit the like, and uh, comment below, have you been to this beautiful McDonald's that overlooks Taal Volcano in Tagaytay? Are there any other spots in Tagaytay that you recommend that are pretty unique? There's some nice Starbucks over here, there's some other restaurants, great Filipino restaurants that are awesome to eat here. I've actually been to one called Josephine's back in the day, and they have a really nice view there. They even have like a grassy knoll area where you can go. There's Lola, Tita Annette, looking young. Still does look young though. Okay, yeah! <laughs> Come on, you go. I'd fly my drone here, but that's a long ways down. I'm a little afraid that if I lost reception of my drone, it'd be, it'd be gone forever. So, sorry for the lack of drone shots, guys. What's up guys, we're here in Paseo in the New Valley area. I'm gonna have dinner at the Cannon Club, but I'm looking for some locks for my parents for their luggages. description of all the foods that we ate right now at a different time I'm sorry right now so that night I got totally burnt out vlogging and I couldn't finish the review and I had all my family with me I was catching up with them over at Cannon Club I wasn't able to vlog that much but to review the food don't go to Max's for lunch because you'll still be full so go with an empty stomach don't eat all day if you have to I'm not a Dinugan person or a Kare Kare person, so I skipped that. I tried the seafood seasick. It was okay. It was decent. Yeah, I ate the pancit. I was still pretty full, so I didn't really eat that much over at Cannon Club. But it's a great family-style restaurant. You can feed 10 or 11 people for 75 to 80 bucks, which is about 3,500 Philippine pesos. So that's it for the Tagay Thai vlog, JK Shiners. We're off to Cebu once again, this time with my parents. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Have you been to places like Max's restaurant? Have you been to Tagay Thai? Have you been to Kanan Club? Comment below, let's talk about it. Anyways guys, I'll see you in the next video. We're headed back to Cebu City. Let's go. She's still